Hi guys, I'm back at my fire pit. So I'm, I need to figure out what's the circumference of a 30 inch diameter. What's the formula guys, help me out. Otherwise I'm gonna have to go in and Google it because I'm not really good at that stuff. But what I am really good at is building the coat of fire pits. So let me measure. And that's because the um, fire liner that I ordered is 30 inches. All right, that's 30 inches. Let's check over here. That's 30 and a quarter. So I want to make sure that it's exactly 30. So I'm just going to bank that in a little. I want to make sure that it's exactly 30 inches. And I have not secured these blocks with the adhesive because I'm going to wait. I can do that later. Let's see. That's 31. I don't know. How long is it going to take me to get to the 30? I'm really looking forward to finishing this Dakota fire pit. It's going to bring so much value to the yurt life experience. It's all about creating beautiful experience for all that stay at the yurt. Yay! Yurt life off grid. Dakota fire pit. Got it. All right, let me check the other side now. Dirty. I'm going to show you these beautiful lava stones that I purchased, which will go to the bottom. We have a whole bucket of these beautiful lava stones. And so that's going to go at the bottom of the pit yeah we're gonna move that trowel out what's up guys but i've been waiting for the um the fire pit liner which i ordered and it was lost so amazon actually sent me a an email letting me know that they thought it was lost and i want to cancel i'm like no i need it just get it here finally it arrived so let's see i hope this I hope this is the one I ordered. Yeah, it went all the way to Canada and then here. I don't know. So I waited so long, I even forgot which one I ordered. So it's called the Cost Way. And it comes in, I think, four parts. One, two, three, four parts. And I have to screw them together to make this a uh, circle. Okay, so I'm gonna put this together. It's a 36 inch fire pit ring, but the inside is 30 inch diameter. So that should fit perfectly with um, my Dakota fire pit, yeah! We'll see. All right, guys, stay tuned. Don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you. So I'm really hoping it fits. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Oh my God, we have some visitors here. Come here, girls. The chickens, they follow me everywhere. So I've been keeping this covered with this plywood to keep the rain out. I think eventually I'll buy some nice cover. Okay. Let's see. I think 
again, as I mentioned, I haven't sealed the blocks to each other yet. They have this uh, fire, what they call fire glue. And that's what I'm gonna use instead of cement. Um, chuck, 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 come on girls. Get away from there. They're getting ready to go under the neighbor's fence. All right, let's see. I could use another person here, but I don't have anyone here. Let's see. Oh no. I can tell it's not gonna fit. Yeah, I have to adjust. I have to adjust the top stones. So, um, but you know what? I have to go visit my granddaughter, so it's gonna have to wait, guys. Can you be patient? I promise you will see a fire in this Dakota fire pit. Yes. Thank you. Until next time.